the final time before we fight the ender dragon has arrived that's not me i'm right here but yes we are fighting the ender dragon this episode we are exploring the end we actually do have an mv mod called end reborn i believe so there might be a little wee bit of content behind that i actually think that mod might have a pretty good armor set we can get don't know if it's better than our dragon steel but still you know it'd be nice to get our hands on something new but yeah i'm just here doing what i do 24 7 even in the streams i'm out here looking for spell books you know how it is but yeah i guess i will see you guys at the end i'm gonna do a little bit more spell hunting and then let's let's get to it let's do it it's time ender dragon fight we've been waiting for a while i've been waiting for a while for this because i want to see what's in the end city in terms of loot will i find better spell books i don't know all right this is a good spawn right away it's not off of the island uh i still have ptsd from you know og ender dragon what is going on in here bro what the hell is that thing what are these why are there slimes in here what mod adds in slimes block slime and then what the hell is that floating thing <laughs> and why is there a battle tower on the main island oh god all right uh i'm kind of scared to summon in anything because what if my my dudes i summon in just start beef with everyone <laughs> What if they just start fighting people, bro? Whatever, I guess we'll find out, right? All right, let's do it. Let's get to it. Let's figure out what's going on. Uh, obviously, we're in the end. We need to break all this stuff. Let's get to it. I can't fly around and do it. Maybe I should do that. Let's go ahead. Let's conjure my bow here. And uh, let's fly. I bet the Ender Dragon did not expect me to have wings this early. If I can, you know, get off of the floor. Bro, I am having trouble getting off of the floor right now. Who would have thought? I'm using a light the whole playthrough, and I can't use it when i get to an important part to use it all right let's do it this is gonna be fun oh flying around and shooting these things is so easy oh he says as he misses it's all good we'll worry about the cage ones last like usual unless you do them first you know whatever order you love to do them go ahead i'm not gonna judge you know most people don't have an elytra while in here so the, this is uh, gonna be a pretty fast run hopefully I don't know if the mod I have installed, the end mod I have installed, affects the uh, damage the Ender Dragon does or attacks it has or what. Who knows? All right, and boom. We may officially begin the Ender Dragon fight. I'm going to summon in some stuff. Let's see what they do. Will, the, will it cause complete hell or not? I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to summon in literally everything that I have. <laughs> Let them do whatever they want. Go ahead, boys. Do what you want. Get killed by the Ender Dragon. Go kill Enderman. Do what you want. Oh, he's perched. This is our time to test. Oh, and he was perched for like half a second. All right, where's he at? Let's get some shots. Some official shots on it. And uh, hopefully my summons keep all the other enemies busy. Which I'm actually excited that there's other enemies here. That my summons can actually protect me from. So they aren't completely useless. Which is a good thing. This dragon is filling this area up with these fireballs, bro. But yeah, I was talking about it earlier. You know, I got like PTSD from like early Minecraft Ender Dragon fights. Because you know when like back in the day you would spawn off of the island. And then the Ender Dragon would legit just come up to you. Right when you spawn in and knock you into the void. Like I can't be the only one that has PTSD from those days, bro. So I'm actually noticing some of my summons are targeting the Ender Dragon. I think these dudes right here, the mages, the unholy uh, alliance mages, they're actually like targeting the dragon. It's pretty cool. What are these flames? I don't know these flames are. They don't go away apparently. Maybe I should wait for a perch and then go for the fire axe. That might actually be good. Oh, 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 oh. hold up, hold up. Who said fire axe spawned in perfect what the hell why does it disappear when i look that direction this is some good damage right here i like how the top says unknown it doesn't know what oh. you're being very loud but yeah it says unknown like it doesn't know the ender dragon is right there <laughs> doesn't detect it as that entity oh it perched again Let's see if i can get some good hits in there okay be careful I don't take fall damage, so if I get knocked up in there, it's not that bad of a thing. Coming down for another perch. I might be able to end it. Let's see. I might be able to end it right here. That would be nice. Boom. Yes, sir. What the hell is that thing? Get away from me. What the hell? <laughs> I didn't even touch you. 
I didn't even look at you. I'm being assaulted. This is like a lightning enderman or something, bro. Alright, there you go. The ender dragon is defeated. Let's gather up all the beautiful XP. Hopefully none of it burns in these like weird looking fires. Yeah, let's make sure we get all of it. You know, you can never go wrong with XP. It doesn't matter what Minecraft version you're playing, bro. Modded, non-modded, you can't go wrong with XP. Also, dragon scale. Amazing, I need that. I'm interested to take a look, though, at all these other mobs. See what they're called before we hop into the portal. Uh, I should grab the egg, too. But yeah, let's do a quick search around just this main island, all right? So we got these guys, the block slimes. What do they drop? Kill this guy, what do they, what do they drop? Don't knock him into the portal. They drop literally just blocks. Okay, that's interesting. I gotta pick up all these scales. I didn't think the Ender Dragon like dropped the scales like everywhere. We got this Biotite, which is from the Quark mod. Yeah, I know about Biotite. It's pretty much like quartz, like dark quartz. Uh, let's head out here. Check out what these blazes are or quote unquote blazes. They are purple guards. Cool. They look cool. And then there's that floating thing that attacked me. There it is. What is this thing called? It is called a greater sprite. And I don't know if it attacks me or not. I don't think it does actually. And now obviously these uh, N or uh, obsidian pillars, they got essence or cool. This is green thing. What's this? Sprightly. I've seen a lot of endermen that look like this. They got multiple eyes, watchers. Interesting. Uh, there was another ore somewhere too, like right here. And diamond. Is this really diamond? Wow. <laughs> nice. There you go. I think that's pretty much everything on the main island. Obviously, things are going to get crazy once we get off of the main island. Celestial crystal. That sounds cool. Zorsite cluster. I'll take some Zorsite. Did I mine it? I don't know. I think I did mine it. I don't know where it dropped, though. There's N lapis. Okay, I don't need lapis. But yeah, there's a lot of cool things here. Oh, there's some more Zorsite. Can I mine this or not? I, I have no idea. Do I need a certain pickaxe? Maybe I need a certain pickaxe. All right. Heading to the overworld, let me drop everything off, and I will see you guys probably at the first island. Why are there towers here? I need to stop accidentally placing my torches. Hey, let me break one of these. I don't know if I need chorus fruit or not, but like, I might as well check. All right, let's get looking for an end city. I'm super hyped to see if there's better loot or not. What is that? Is there something over here? There might be some structures. Yeah, look at that. What's that? Kind of don't like that. There's these annoying blazes everywhere. Here we go. Wolves handle that. Wait, is that diamond? Hold up. And diamond, nether diamond, I don't care, I want it. Okay, so this looks like it's just nothing besides like this essence ore. I don't even know, do I need essence ore? Maybe. It's the advanced ender pearl, runic purple block. What if I surround it by eight purple blocks? Do they mean this block itself or do they mean the, the recipe? I don't know. Uh, magnetor, magnet for mobs, that's cool. Phantom blocks, also cool. Uh, I wonder what's in the mod, the, uh, the end mod. Or should I type reborn? Let's see. Yeah, there's purple guards, which are the blazes. There's watchers. I don't know what that is. And mage Barclay. That sounds like a boss. Chronologists, which we've seen. They're just like Endermen with like yellow eyes. Is that it? There's four spawn eggs. So that I'm assuming this one's a boss. One of them has to be a boss. Come on, yeah. The end reborn mod at least be one boss. All right, let's go. It's time to fly. What the hell is that? A pillar out here? That's interesting. Look at that. Let's get the elytra, because we don't own like 10 of them already. <laughs> shulkers? No, we own that too. There's not, there's not much uh, that's exclusive to me right now. I do need to kill Shulkers though. And I wonder how my summons work against Shulkers. Let's see. Let's jump the one that's down here. Get his ass. Get his ass. Let's see how they fight the Shulker. Good job. They're overwhelming it. I still got hit somehow. Okay, that's actually not bad. Is fairly quick. There is an item that the shulkers drop and it makes me immune to levitation. Need that. Need that right away. But here you go. This is our first taste of a modded end city loot. Let's see. I guess it's the end boat. Not a new spell book. And if it was a new one, it would have been a novice one. Okay, a little upsetting so far. This one. Look at the diamond chest plate. Looking nice with the enchantments on it. I'll take it. But uh so far, loot's been pretty trash. Boys, if you would like to, you know, just do whatever. Go murder some things. You know, take some shots for me. Go ahead. Might as well. Ooh, look at that. We got a music disc. That's nice. Uh, so far, bad loot again. Oh, my. It is an angel feather. 
that i'll take that because it has mending on it that's probably one of the best things is the armor here this has shulker core three does that make things levitate when you hit it that's what i would have said life steal four capturing four capturing four i might be able to use for something but so far again loot atrocious it's looking bad now i didn't expect diamonds and baubles and gleaming gemstones that's like something skyrim merchants say but i was expecting at least like okay stuff so i mean it is okay the armors are okay that's always the best thing about the end cities is the armor so that's not bad because i could disenchant those and get some good reforges but like come on i mean we could be doing better all right so i have looted a good couple of end cities at this point all four of them that i've found in the last 30 minutes uh the loot has been absolute trash and it really sucks <laughs> Look at this end city. Uh, amazing, right? There's not even a chest in it either. That's the better thing. But like, bro, the tra the loot is more trash than it usually is. <laughs> Which is insane. I didn't think that it would be worse with the mods. But I guess, I don't know. Maybe chests are being overridden or something. But uh, I don't know, man. I keep on like getting these ideas in my head. Like, oh, maybe I finally got a way to get the spells that I'm missing. And then we do the idea and it just disappoints me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah. Let me look into uh let me look into some stuff here with the end reborn mod and uh, let's do some stuff from there all right here i am literally weeks upon weeks later uh it probably didn't take me that long to figure out what to do next in the mod but you know i just had to take a little break we're going hard on minecraft summoner in terms of streams and stuff but yeah pretty much the only thing that i really care about in this mod is kind of the armor and even then i don't care our current armor is better but there's one boss from the mod and we're gonna fight that boss boom we need this runic purple block very simple we just need purple blocks we just need essence and we just need purple rune purple rune requires purple shards purple shards we get from chests apparently i guess i thought it was also a mob drop don't remember if i'm being 100 percent honest do i have them? i have two of them uh oh i swear i had more than that let's see aha we did have more than that where'd they go boom right here so give me eight of them that's how much i needed right eight and then an ender pearl very simple put this together and boom bada bing purple ruin i see you I, I don't know who sees me but what's up uh and then we pull out the essence do i have purple blocks or too too much essence do i have purple blocks i do not have purple blocks okay very easy way to get purple blocks you ready for this you go to the end cities you steal the purple blocks yep as easy as that unless they have like a decently easy recipe no we need popcorn fruit do not have popcorn fruit but yeah it's very simple we get these blocks we do this recipe and then we get even more blocks and we place eight blocks around it so we literally place that there and then we place the blocks around it in the end boom we fight our boss and the boss shouldn't be too hard especially since you know i'm a summoner it should be an easy w so yeah apparently this version of the uh end reborn mod we're playing with kind of sucks well i guess i had some wolves out here that didn't despawn the like current version for 1.16 i believe is the current version for this mod uh, and usually like a majority of 1.16 mods are way better which you know kind of made me sad when i had to make this mod pack 1.12 only because the wizardry mod wasn't updated to 1.16 which really sucked because like man 1.16 modding compared to 1.12 and anything else insane i love 1.16 mods but yeah uh the end reborn mod on 1.16 offers a lot more and i kind of didn't know that like the 1.12 version was way like just way more ass just to be blunt with it but uh you know oh well it happens that's usually how it is but yeah boom i got a bunch of purple blocks awesome amazing let's fight the boss we have to fight it here in the end i believe that's literally all is just you need to do it in the end let's do it i don't know if these wolves are gonna despawn bro they kind of been here for a minute okay let's get to it i got my full armor on got my gold apple out what else do i need the better gold apple sure and then let's hold a totem in our hand we're being extra safe let's get to it wait i have to craft it don't forget to craft it that's that's pretty important right there boom got it all right uh let's do it on the floor let's do it on the floor might as well hopefully i don't get assaulted by anything too crazy hello can you guys kill these things here i'll, I'll summon in some vexes go ahead help out kill them hey hopefully they drop the the thing i need nope they didn't drop it okay that's fine i put this in the middle oh yeah i guess it doesn't matter and mage barclay let's beat his ass beat his ass everybody hey don't be flying off where'd he go 
That boy flying. Uh, I don't know what to use. If he flies. He's bringing the Phoenix, I guess. I don't know if you guys have seen this Phoenix. This Phoenix is cool. Let's bring in uh, our projectile boys. Let's try and keep them at bay, though. I don't want to send them flying around too much. It looks like he's shooting wither skulls at us. That's pretty dangerous. Let's bring in uh, the boys, the wolves. Little infantry units we can send in here. You know, my favorite thing about this uh, summoner series, it, it low-key feels like an RTS. You know, real-time strategy type of game. And I fuck with RTSs, man. An example of RTS is, you know, you got Kingdom Rush, you got, uh, hey, don't knock them over the void now. Hey, go this way. Go that way. Uh, Kingdom Rush, StarCraft, those are some examples. Uh, there's literally a game I played on the GameCube, and I loved it, called Army Men RTS. And you played and controlled, like, a bunch of plastic army men. Very, very fun game. I don't like his positioning. So this is what I'm gonna do, okay? You know nothing. Hey. Shut the fuck up, John Snowhead ass. I'm gonna I'm gonna play it safe here. I'm gonna try and keep him over the land for obvious reasons. I don't want his items to drop into the void. Can we like let's let's move you onto some land? All right, hey, calm down, Mr. Uh, Iron Golem. Like I might have to just give him a floor, bro. You need a floor to stand on. I got you, bro. I'm working on it. All right. I just have to knock him all the way over there and hope I don't kill him. And then we can finish him off with some summons. That's good enough. He's like far enough away. Is that guy attacking me? Alright, get him, boys. Somebody get him. He's running. Why are you running? Get his ass. This is our chance to strike. He's back on land. This is our chance to get his ass. He really tried to stalemate the fight by go. Hey, bro, what the hell? He really tried to stalemate the fight by getting off of the land. He really tried it. Whatever, bring in everything. I just want this dude to be dead at this point. Come on, you guys got it. He's so close. You guys got it. Somebody get him. Somebody. Just finish this dude. I'm getting attacked by Enderman and shit now. Somebody just kill him. To rise, you need to fall. I know all about that. My fucking job is YouTube. You know what? I'm getting up here. He's bringing me up here. I'm getting up here with him. Okay. I, I guess not. I'm going back down. I'm not going to lie. This dude's kind of annoying, bro. Just like die already. Why are you regenerating so much health? He's regenning so much health. Like, bruh. <laughs> Your boss fight's not even that interesting. Can you die? This dude's been using the same attack like he's a level 5 Pokemon. Like, come on, man. Let's just end it. And he's dead. There we go. Thank God. That was a long-ass fight for no reason. Look at that. We're getting Halloween trick-or-treat bags. <laughs> Alright, now that he's finally dead, we have broken sword part. Which makes End Mage Barclay Sword. Right click this heliport. Ooh. Low key, I feel like that'd be pretty useful. We just need uh, Endorium. How do we get Endorium? Wow, that's really easy. Okay. Let's make that. Let's make that. Then I end the episode off. All right. So to make this, we need something called String of Life. And it's made out of infused Endorium. And you can hear me clicking. Uh, it's not telling me uh, what infused Endorium is or like what the crafting is. So, what I assume is, there's a lot of cool things we can make with this. Look at this. What is this? Changes some blocks to their destroyed state. Interesting. Magnet for mobs. That's actually kind of cool. Uh, but I'm assuming we need this. The heat of this forge changes the properties of some materials. Void forge. Which requires some, uh, some end stone. What else? What the hell is a Zorsite shard? Huh? What is a Zorsite? Zorsite shard? Is there a Zorsite ore? <laughs> Zorsite. There's a Zorsite ore. Did I, do I have this? I might have some of this then. Because I have mined a couple of ores as well as there. And like low key might have accidentally picked some up. I am not seeing any Zorsite. Okay. Looks like the ending of this episode is going to take me a little bit more time than I thought. Back to the end. All right. One more Andorium ingot. Bang. Put it all together. Bang. Yes, sir. And Mage Barclay Sword. 
Collect the end mage bar. Yep, that's pretty much what I just said. And let's see it in action here. Oh, so it throws out an ender pearl. Okay, okay, I see how it is. I mean, that's kind of cool. It, you don't take damage from it, which is pretty cool. I think I like the idea that you have a weapon and a teleporting thing all at the same time. Very nice. Probably won't use that at all if I'm being 100% honest. I could fly, but still cool. I like the idea of it. But there you go. That was the end theme episode. Like I said, there's a couple of things here and there. Uh, I will check out the dragon armor. I probably will make this obsidian armor because look what I've been working on over here. Don't know if I showed this off already, but you know, we got a little armory coming together. Still a work in progress, but we'll see what happens with this room. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I'll see y'all next time. Next episode, I think it's finally time to hop into the Twilight Forest. Now, I want to think how I want to do this episode because I do want to hop in there probably naked uh no armor i might keep my accessories but no armor and i don't know if i'm just gonna use summons from the twilight forest i think i'll bring an empty one but i'll still bring my one uh because as you can see there is a lot of twilight forest stuff and i plan to use most of this stuff from it because you know there's a decent amount of summons there and uh you, we don't want to blaze through it too fast but at the same time i do kind of want to blaze through it a little fast because we don't want to spend too much time in there it's the twilight forest everyone has seen the twilight forest but yeah hope you guys enjoyed i'll see y'all next time bye, -bye, -bye, -bye.